بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم مائی ویلیوبل لسنرز آئی ہوپ دیٹ مائی دس نیو ویڈیو فائنڈز یو فائن اینڈ آئی آلسو ہوپ دیٹ یو آر فل آف اینرجی ٹو نو دا بیسکس آف انگلش گرامر ان ٹو ڈیز کلاس دی ٹاپک آف آر ٹو ڈیز ڈسکشن از ویری سمپل اینڈ ایزی آئی بی ٹیلنگ یو اباؤٹ tenses before we start off i would like to ask you people to subscribe my channel and click the bell icon for updates and news let's get started first let me tell you about the definition of a tense so that you may know what actually a tense is A tense may be defined as a verb based method which is used to indicate the time and sometimes the continuation or completeness of an action. Moreover, we can also say that the concept of English tenses is used to refer time or a state of being which simply means that the tense of a verb shows the time of action. There are three main verb tenses in English language. They are present, past, and future. The present tense shows the action done at present time. The past tense shows that the action was performed in the past. It may have been performed in the near or far past. while the future tense shows that an action will be performed in future let's move on and talk about the four main aspects of a tense the first main aspect of a tense is called indefinite or simple The second one is known as continuous or progressive. The third one is called perfect. And the fourth one is known as perfect continuous. Let me now tell you about the four main aspects of present tense. The first one is simple present or present indefinite. The second one is known as present continuous. Another name of present continuous is present progressive. Here you can see the third main aspect of a present tense which is present perfect. Here is the fourth main aspect of present tense and it is present perfect continuous. Now There are four main aspects of present tense. Similarly, we shall be talking about four main aspects of past as well as future tense. Here you can see the four main aspects of past tense which are number 1 past indefinite or simple past. Number 2 past continuous or past progressive. Number 3 past perfect and number 4 past perfect continuous Now let's talk about the four main aspects of future tense They are number 1 future indefinite and you can see another name for future indefinite is simple future Number 2 future continuous Number 3 future perfect and number 4 future perfect continuous Now you know that the total number of tenses in English language is 12 4 from present tense 4 from past tense and four 
from future tense. So the total number becomes 12. Thank you so much for watching. See you very soon with another video. Till then, take care. Allah Hafiz.